Hey guys, got an app for you. It's only one today because this is such an amazing app. So let's start. The app is called Remote Pro. Um, there is a cheaper one. I believe it's like uh, nine nine cents. This one was three dollars. So let's start. Okay, so basically what it does is basically a Apple remote just on your iPod. You need Wi-Fi to use this. It goes through your Wi-Fi into your laptop or Mac or whatever. And then you can control it. So let's start here. Let's give it a minute. There it goes. Here we have front row open, so here you can see me using the remote. So let's go into theatrical trailers. Um, let's play a movie uh, Iron Man 2 so here's my other hand I'm not doing it with another one here Now I'm going to pause it. I want one. No. Push in the middle. It's going to stop it there so we don't have any copyright issues. And then to back out, you just push the menu button. Menu. Menu. And as you're just playing get out of front row, you just push the menu button. But this app can also do another thing. You also have wireless it's like a keyboard so here and I can open up Chrome if I just push tap and Chrome opens up. You can type from it too. You can bring up the keyboard, shake it or push the bottom with the button at the bottom and let's go YouTube, oh. YouTube, and search. Oh wow, I didn't even spell YouTube right. And there it is. There's a bunch of machinima videos. So that is this app, and. Here, if I go back into this part, you have your settings button. Can you see that? Um, here, let me just back up. Okay, so now you can see a bit better. Okay, so at the bottom here, you have settings, application, and connection. There's a little light beside the connection that tells you when you're connected. Green for connected, red for not. So let's go into apps. You can open front row, boxy, DVD player, ITV. There is a bunch of other ones here, so I can even go basically the dock at the top. Here I'll open up pages. There it goes. Then you just close that. Go into the wireless mouse. Choose. 
Now you can type. Zoom in on the laptop here. Oh, damn the brightness here. There's the cursor. So let's type something. This is a test. There. I wouldn't recommend doing like whole projects on this. That's what the keyboard's there for, but it's actually pretty cool. There's a non uh pro one. I'm not I think it just doesn't have the mouse capability. Depends on your preference, whether you want it, whether you want the mouse part or not. So, that is it for today's <coughs> app review, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.